Round one. Fight! Let the cold be your tomb. Sub-Zero wins. Flawless victory. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Mortal Kombat 11 Augment Build video. And today I'll be going over my Insta-Kill Golden Axe Cold Shoulder Luckality Augment Build for Sub-Zero. If you're wondering exactly where to get Luckality, you can find Luckality inside of the new Test Your Luck Towers when you play them on Brutal Difficulty. And if you want a level 4, which is the max level, play the tower that requires 2,500 hearts and, fought, and fight the boss tower on Brutal Difficulty. Brutal difficulty, and it will drop for whatever character you just killed inside of that tower. And on average, this is taking me about one, two, three hits to instantly kill my opponent. Right before I get into the video, just make sure you're hitting all those good buttons you can press down below, like the like button and the subscribe button, because you do get benefits when you are subscribed. For instance, when you are subscribed and you recommend a video down in the comment section below, I am more likely to do your video or at least do your video sooner. Not only that, but it does help me with producing these videos every single day for you guys. So it's a win-win scenario. If you want to make this a win-win-win scenario, make sure to share with a friend or anybody that can, or anybody that can find this video useful. And in fact, you can actually make this a win-win-win-win scenario because I am producing a new type of video, which, uh, you know, just trying to meet a, like, stemming off of just the ordinary MK11 augment build stuff because, you know, we don't want the content to become stale, and I would enjoy some criticism on that video. So let's go ahead and hop right into this augment build. So the very first two augments I've equipped or what allows us to be able to instantly kill, and this is a level 4 luckality and lucky rabbit's foot. So level 4 luckality reads, we have an 8% chance for our brutalities to automatically trigger and instantly kill our opponent, no matter how much health our opponent has left or what round we're on. And when you pair that with a lucky rabbit's foot, which increases your luck by 100%, it effectively just doubles the chance of getting that luckality brutality from an 8% to a 16% chance. If you're wondering exactly how that works, luck is simply increasing your positive modifier and positive modifiers and decreasing your negative modifiers. And since uh luckality falls under the category of a positive modifier, it, it gets increased by what 100 percent And 100 percent of any number is simply just double that number, and double of eight is going to be 16. For the next two augments, we have a cheap hit and a level 4 fire sale. So this is a, basically just allows us to be able to infinitely amplify our move. Because cheap hit makes our offensive gauges have, and basically fire sale does the same thing. So you'll be able to amplify something 8 times instead of just the original 2 you would be able to amplify before. And of course your bars do just simply um, refill over time. The next two augments I've equipped are the main defensive part of this build, and this is level 3 armor clad and a level 3 pumped up. So level 3 pumped up simply gives us 750 more health, which is going to be useful, especially if you're finding something like a boss tower, cob tower, or even a tester lock tower, because you want to be able to take a bit more damage before you're just killed. Next is going to be a level 3 armor clad. So this allows us to be able to absorb hits without getting hit out, out of whatever move we're trying to do. It also prevents us from being comboed. For the uh, Jinsei Augments, I have a level 4 Stone Cold, which gain a 100% chance to throw an extra axe during Polar Axe. Next is going to be a level 4 Winter Scroll. So this one is insanely helpful with the build because it does increase the distance of Cold Shoulder by 100%, basically, basically allowing you to be able to hit them from full screen. Next is going to be a level 4 Blizzard Condition. So this makes us do 8 extra uh, icicles uh, during Death Circles Barrage, which is just going to be helpful if you do want to mix it up. For the abilities, I currently use Cold Shoulder, Rising Ice, and Death Circle Barrage. For the AI behavior, I use 20 combos, uh, 20 reversal, and 20 zoning. So, uh, yeah, that's my ARC build. If you have any recommendations, make sure to leave those down in the comment section below, and I'll do my best to respond to you. And if I can't, I can guarantee you some of this amazing community will, because we do love uh, talking to each other. Not only that, but you should consider joining this amazing community. I do post you every single day, uh, and uh, it just would really help me out. And the fact that, like, 80% of the people that watch these videos aren't actually subscribed, I would really help if that number would, uh, you know, go down. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope I see you in the next one. Peace. Round one, fight! Mentality. Ability to freeze. Sub-Zero wins. Flawless victory. Round one, fight! Mentality. Combat is finished. Sub-Zero wins. 
flawless victory. Round one, fight. Let the cold be your tomb. Sub-Zero wins. Flawless victory. Round one, fight. Your last. Sub Zero wins. Flawless victory. Yeah,